take your vocal mixing sounding from this to this apne piya ke mein bal bal ja bhai maza aaya सो ये वीडियो थोड़ा बड़ा होने वाला है बिकॉज एवरी वन इज लुकिंग फॉर अ परफेक्ट गुड रील फॉर देयर साउंड सो फर्स्टली आई हैव थ्री थिंग्स ओवर हियर फर्स्ट इज कीज सेकेंड इज बेज एंड बेसिक पैड लेयर आई मेक यू लिसन सो फर्स्ट कीज ट्रैक वन एज कीज सो कीज हैज थ्री थिंग्स अ स्प्लिट स्टेरियो LA to it and a river these uh, split stereo i use for stereo widening i always use ps22 in keys just to have a wide effect uh, whenever you want one instrument to sound like one instrument then definitely use this preset uh, it will be really helping you and uh, this is a keyboard player preset from this drop down this is a waves plugin very amazing plugin after that a default reverb on keys these are the settings and last in l2 a compressor for final vocal volume are final keys volume and uh, yeah this is in keys secondarily i have a pack i have a bass bass i have one distorter which is from sound type which is from sound toys decapitator and this is the dark fat preset i'm using it might be tweaked somewhere yeah second is an eq a small dip at 136 hertz to get a bit space for vocals as well and uh, a last bass compression la3 a mono and uh, yeah these are the settings and a pad layer pad mix stereo enhancer ja raha hai the stereo enhancer is specifically to make space and to push it backwards in the mix i use this one and parametric eq to cut off the lows and yeah these are the settings nothing much going coming down to the vocals the vocals are already been melodyne and i always say i look three things in a vocal mix so firstly going through an avalon preamp and a manly box box channel strip and a dsa because i felt the vocals were very breathy so i used a dsa at the starting second thing i always say use a good compression so i have started with uptech style compression and eq step 2 uh, bandwidth mein broad uh, i've kept it broad thoda boost and yeah these are the settings a low uh, low cut and a high cut of at 15 and yeah this is a uptech style again after that pro g i have used in this one i have used vocal all round preset no changes made after that because i felt the vocal was in perfect transience with that step 3 virtual mix rack which has a c akg c12 the legend mic emulation a 1070p mic and a london style tube preamp after like adding a most colors in the voice and a final vocal compression step 4 after that the channel the third channel has a compressor on suit no the third channel has an eq a dsr and a final vocal compression so it looks like this a uh, high shelf and a dip over here khatam bye bye tata good and step 5 yes so these are the vocal settings i have used after that there are multiple reverbs going on firstly i have a parallel compression after that to get the proper vocal volume and i am using skeps omni channel over here these are the settings it is a very detailed plugin multiple things are happening over here and yes after that first i have a plate reverb by valhalla these are the settings uh, every send has been made over here and uh, 
each and every proportion are different as per the sound you can suggest i'll uh, give you a amazing tip if you are watching the video till now it's great so the tip is in your master bus keep a controller which has a mid side option selection if you uh, uh, use isot of imager it also gives an option to listen the side information of the track uh, you will be very knowingly know that uh, by listening these sides you can definitely uh, get the visual image of a reverb you want in the track you can also take take some legendary tracks like bruno mars charlie booth yeah, or anyone you like just drag and drop the track over here in the master bus keep a controller turn on the sides of that track you will know how amazingly they have crafted their art so yes learning and firstly going back to the reverbs firstly uh, going through a plate reverb after that having a room reverb a smooth room preset i always use in my mixes the third is the third is valhalla delay and fourth is cinematic rooms so these are the reverbs i'm using for the vocal mix i hope the video was very informational i've tried as much as detail i can and thanks for watching see you guys in the next video